How you doing, young lady? The feeling that you're giving really drives me crazy. You don't have a play about the choke. I was at the loss of word first time that we spoke. You're looking for a Hello you guys and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. My name is Nicole and I post videos on here every Sunday and occasionally some Thursdays but I've been pretty bad about that lately. But anyways today I am heading out the door as we speak. I'm going to meet one of my best friends for breakfast. We are going to a delicious crepe place so I am so excited and then I think we're just gonna walk around do a bit of shopping maybe grab like a coffee or hot chocolate and yeah that's about it. I think it's just gonna be a wholesome fall day in my life. Just seeing my friend Olivia so I am so excited and I'm actually running a little bit late so we're gonna head out the door and I will see you guys once we're there just a quick little outfit of the day I have this old navy little jacket on it's super cute white coach purse my Uggs and we are heading out the door because I always manage to be late somehow okay you guys I'm now just walking over to the restaurant and I will see her in literally a minute I know what you've been through, been through. I know what you like, I know what you like. I know you about it, about it. When we turn off the light, that's right. I know that you want me, want me. Oh, I ain't no fool, oh, I ain't no fool. We've been going at it, at it for a minute or two. Yeah, yeah. Darling, you got the sweetest heart, and I don't want it to break. That frown on your face got me. Just walking back to my car now. I don't really know what I want to do with the rest of today. I kind of just feel like going out and about. So I think I might do a little bit of Christmas shopping maybe. It's so beautiful out. I love it. It was so nice seeing Olivia. We definitely need to hang out more often, but life just gets so in the way sometimes but i'm very happy that we took the time to see each other hang out great day so far we literally just spoke the entire time so that was like super nice it was very overdue i'm just at my car now i will check what i need to do i want to buy halloween candy just because my family stopped handing out halloween candy for like the past few years and i just miss it i want to bring back that like spark if you will i'm so sorry for the angle but i want to buy halloween candy and I don't know what else, but probably Christmas gifts. I got my grandpa a windbreaker jacket, a classic, really nice winter jacket, or windbreaker jacket, sorry. And I figured he would love that. So I texted my mom, she told me to buy it. So I think that'll be part of his Christmas gift. I'm just gonna quickly run into winners just because there's one thing in particular I wanna buy for someone for Christmas. And I just wanna see if this location has it. And then I'm gonna go home and my mom and I are gonna go out and do some shopping. Yeah. Been riding now, fueling fire again. What's this like the sixth time since we first When you call, I can't fight it. What a major throwback. The Powerpuff Girls. Something in the way you move, keep on drawing me in. Those lips I know so well, they excite me. Said I'm thinking I'll maybe get this for my brother's girlfriend just because her birthday's coming up and I figured she would like this. But we'll see. I'll text my brother and find out. I'm like the back of my hand, back of my hand. I know what you've been through, been through. I know what you. Okay, so I did not find anything in Winners. Unfortunately, they had a lot of Halloween stuff on sale, but I don't need to waste my money. I don't even drink coffee or anything, so I don't need a mug, but I loved that mug. And there was also the cutest spoon rest. I'm obsessed with it. It was a gingerbread. It was $8. Very tempted, but I don't have a home yet. I don't need to purchase a spoon rest, but it was adorable. Now I'm gonna go home and head out with my mom. You guys, I'm literally baffled. It took me 20 minutes to get home and I live five minutes away from where I was. Traffic was ridiculous. Oh my God. I wasted so much gas just in idle, like waiting. It was cause all the schools broke out. So there was a ton of traffic, so many buses and everything, which is very annoying, but I'm finally home. My mom should be home in I think 15-ish minutes. So as soon as she's home, I think we'll head out. And also I have a little update for you guys. Just let me hang out my coat and I'll be right back. Okay, I think I'm gonna leave you guys there and we'll just have a quick chat. So essentially I have been needing a car for a while now. I know nothing about cars. I was extremely, extremely 
overwhelmed with the thought of having to purchase a car so quickly just because I haven't even received a paycheck from work yet. Like I haven't gotten a paycheck in a while because I quit my job back in end of July. I miss that job a lot, but I know just professionally, personally, like I need to move on. I need to grow as a nurse. I need to grow as a person. I need to go on and just, you know, move throughout life and um, have like better pay and everything. That's why I got my nursing degree. And now that I'm working, I'm so excited, but obviously working my shifts are day, day, night, night. So essentially I work 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. for day shifts and 7 p.m. to 7 a.m. for night shifts. Essentially I have four shifts on. I then have five days off and then I repeat that cycle over and over and over. And so with that, I'm obviously going to be working a lot and I need a car. The prices of everything right now is is ridiculous cars that were not worth thirty thousand dollars were being priced at thirty thousand dollars like fully used cars like a 2018 car with over a hundred thousand kilometers was twenty eight thousand dollars without tax i couldn't fathom that i don't know i was just overwhelmed and all of this is just to say i bought a car so i actually bought it off of my dad i've been borrowing his car essentially for a while now he works from home and then whenever he's traveling for work obviously doesn't need a car and then whenever he is home anything he needs a car for it my mom is usually going with him it was a fantastic fantastic deal still more expensive than what I wanted to spend but for the quality of the car it has 22,000 kilometers on it I'll get into that once I do like a proper car video but I don't want to say what car it is yet even though some of you probably already know but yeah I have a car which is crazy so a car video will be coming I feel so broke right now it's not even funny I'm going to pay it off over the next four years if not sooner and yeah I just paid a deposit yeah the car is quite literally mine now which is crazy to say I never thought in a million years I would have a car before I even have a paycheck from my stable full-time job so I don't know life is working very differently than I thought I'm just so excited overwhelmed it's just so many emotions but expect a car video I'm going to do a car tour I want to get some car gadgets and kind of just stock up my car that's just a little update for you guys I know we haven't chatted in a while it's always scary starting new chapters I'm not good with change I get very happy content I don't want to move hence why I was at my last job for over three years because I loved it it was like a family but you know I need to push myself to get out of my comfort zone life needs to start I've been with my boyfriend for almost five and a half years now and we're both at a point where we're just we want to start our lives together and it's crazy to think about but i also think we might be living together for a few months but i'm not entirely sure i guess we'll just play it by ear i also think i'm probably going to be engaged within the next year i would say which is crazy to think about i went ring shopping with my boyfriend sorry it is so bright i went ring shopping with my boyfriend saw some rings i know exactly what i want or i know exactly what i like i just i'm stuck between two rings and I just want to try each of them on. So there's one store in particular that has the exact ring I think I want in store, ready to try on. So we made an appointment and we're gonna go there, try it on because every other jeweler, they just have the stone, if that, and you kind of have to like imagine what it would look like. I don't wanna imagine what it would look like if we're spending that much money on a ring. I want to know exactly what it's like. I wanna know 1000% that I want that ring for the rest of my life. But yeah, if I don't like it, I'm going for the other ring that I know I like crazy your girl is growing up so it's just so overwhelming new job new car potential engagement in the next year I'm personally not really like in a rush to get engaged but we have been together for a while we've been talking about it for a while I will leave this here I've been ranting for too long and my mom is also calling me I'll see you guys in a minute hello you guys so little intermission here I just got a package at the door so I just wanted to quickly open it and share it with you guys it is from Vivaya shoes I really hope I'm pronouncing that right but I have my exacto knife. Let's go ahead and open it up. Oh, it smells good. So Vivaya reached out to me and they have a whole wide array of products. This includes shoes, purses, you name it. So a little bit about Vivaya is that they specialize in crafting sustainable footwear and they use 3D technology to recycle plastic bottles and turn that into eco-friendly footwear. So Vivaya is overall an amazing brand and I cannot wait to unbox it. So let's go right ahead. I was able to pick out three items. So I picked out a purse and two pairs of shoes and I'm so excited to open it up. So this is the Vivaya Cream Ivory and green shade and it is just like a big tote bag if you will but I'm so excited for this 
It comes in this beautiful dust bag and it just says Favaya on there. We have the tote bag. Oh my gosh. This is like great material. Holy wow okay so this is the bag that i chose but the bag essentially just flattens out a bit and you can use it for anything and everything so i'm pretty sure it is made with recycled materials at least they have like some plastic water bottles on the logo here i'm assuming for the recycled part yeah so it is made with recycled polyester so recycled materials there's a 3d knit technology big capacity it is very spacious in here it is machine washable which is always nice also because i spill a lot of my stuff and it it is also lightweight so this is it and it is honestly so stunning I don't know if you can tell but just the quality on the straps is crazy and I can take this with me to the beach to go shopping a night out I think this is perfect so I'm so excited to use this in the summer and they also have the via embossed right here so there we have it it is so beautiful and it's just so sleek you really can't get better than this the quality on here is truly unmatched and it is woven so I can stick my nail in between here. And on the inside of the bag it's just this kind of olive green color and there are no pockets so you have plenty room to quite literally put anything and everything that you need inside. Next up I have two pairs of shoes. So here is a box, it is beautiful, it just says step into conscious comfort. And these are stylish yet sustainable shoes. So let's open it right up very beautifully packaged oh yes okay so i saw these and i fell in love just because they're such a staple shoe that you can truly wear with anything and everything and you can really dress it up or dress it down it is just a navy blue loafer with just like the tiniest little bit of a heel right there let's take this out oh wow this is really comfy so on the bottom here you have a little gel cushion here for comfort it is kind of just lined which is always really nice so i got a size 8 which is a 39 in european sizing i just went off their size guide and then i also really do like the sole that they have here it provides a nice amount of traction and then we just have the corresponding shoe right here the quality is really really nice they're definitely not going to get snagged easily i also feel like it's the kind of material that water would kind of just bounce right off off of and they also provide a little card here just for shoe care and these shoes are in the color Samantha Navy. Last but not least I have my second shoe. Same box but this time I got sandals and they're in the color Nisha Black and they're woven and I got the same size 39 in European sizing but I am an 8 for US sizing. Let's go ahead and open it up. I love when brands put extra effort into packaging their stuff. It just makes the world of a difference. So these are some beautiful slides. I just think they're so perfect for summer. And I also love how you have a little bit of a platform, if you will, but still nothing crazy. So these are the shoes. I love them. I think these will go with anything and everything. And you also even have the support even down to your toes, which is always nice. And they just have their engraving right here. So these do have some nice weight to it, which is always nice. I would have loved having these on vacation. I think this for dinner and also just during the day would have been so nice and versatile. So I'm gonna quickly try these shoes on and just show you how they look. All right, you guys, so here we have the first pair. They're super comfortable. And then these are the sandals. They definitely fit nice. I definitely have extra wiggle room if I needed to. But yeah, these are super cute. I like them. All right, you guys, that about wraps up this Vivea haul. I really hope I'm pronouncing that right. They're quality is fantastic. I have never felt such a heavy duty yet lightweight yet properly made tote bag in my life. It is amazing. My mom also fell in love with the bag so I might share with her occasionally just to be a nice daughter but I absolutely love everything. It is going to be perfect for fall as well. The tote bag is the most versatile though. You could bring it on a day trip or you can even wear it to like a little date night. I absolutely love everything so thank you so much to Vivaya for reaching out. I really hope to work together again in the future and I'm just so in love with every single piece. I know that was a very big intermission but we'll resume with the rest of the video now. About it, about it. When we turn off the lights, right? I know that you want me, want me. Oh, I ain't no fool. Oh, I ain't no fool. We've been going at it, at it for a minute or two. Yeah, yeah. Darling, you got the sweetest heart, and I don't want it to break. That frown on your face got me hurting. I'm afraid it's too late. It's not that I don't trust you. I don't trust myself I said patience is a must boo Things will turn out well 
Lost count of the years since I've been here by your side in and out through all these tears. For the final stop of the night, we are at Marshall's. We can do it again, it ain't no problem. Like a switch since we stay more than friends. Alright, you guys, I just got home and I am exhausted. So I'm gonna get in bed, but I really do hope you guys enjoyed the vlog today. If you did, please forget to give it a big ol' thumbs up, subscribe, and turn on my post notifications. That way you guys never miss any uploads. And as always, I will see you guys in the next one. You're looking for a girl that'll treat you right. Have you looking for in the daytime with a light? You might be the type if I play my cards right. I'll find out by the end of the night. You expect me to just let you hit it, but will you still respect me if you can?